Okay. All right. How y'all doing? Um, first YouTube video. Um, quality's bad. Doing it off my phone. You know, every excuse, you know, under the sun why, you know, this isn't perfect. But whatever. Um, this is my first purchase from Watch Finder. I got interested in watches, I don't know, maybe over a year or so ago. I've been watching all, you know, videos on YouTube about watches and Mr. Wonderful videos and then the the the, the Teddy guy and just just watching all those videos. I just got inspired. So I was like, you know what, I'm gonna take a leap and purchase my first watch. Um, of course, I didn't take a huge leap. Like, this isn't a Rolex. This isn't, you know, an AP. It's not even an Omega or anything like that. I went with the Hamilton, um, the, the khaki field, but it is a limited edition one. Um, it's the one that they used in the 2021 uh, video game Far Cry. So I thought, hey, you know, if I'm going to get, you know, a starter watch, at least I'm going to get a limited edition starter watch and then I can keep it and then it'll be a story um, to tell later. Um, and I actually did go get the video game. Um, I just started it. So I'm gonna play through that with my kids, um, you know, this week or whatever, you know, on my off days. So I'm going to go ahead and open up the box here. This is from watch finder. This is very reputable source. You know, of course I was nervous buying something online, but whatever, whatever. Um, the watch is, it's not brand new. Um, I'm going to set this up like this for a second. One second, guys. Um, so, and we will have to edit that out or not. This is all authentic here. So, let me set the camera right here. This is, this is like straight impromptu video and my phone keeps falling so and hopefully this is i'm like literally setting this against my starbucks cup so you have this here let me make sure you guys can see that in camera let me get that way watch binder this little i don't know what it is authenticity receipt whatever whatever i don't know it's closed so I'll just leave it alone. We'll look at that later. Um, and let me pick the camera back up. So we got the box, it's in the paper. I mean, I'm not gonna do anything with this, so I'll just rip it. But it looks, looks legit, looks quality. I was a little bit nervous, you know, buying this online. I think I paid like, I think it was like, 1200 something like that 1220 bucks um so looks like it's coming in original box original papers so this is nice um first real watch let me set this down again like i said i'm sorry about the quality but you know you gotta start somewhere and this is where i'm starting and I'm not gonna make any excuses. You know, everybody says, oh, I'm gonna make a YouTube video. And then we never do, I never do, so. Hey, whatever. Judge me how you judge me. It's me. All right, so look, this is this is good. The box is good. It says Hamilton, looks fresh, you know. It's not, it wasn't, you know, stated to be brand new, so. There's a Starbucks cup. This is our tripod. Um, so we may need the tripod again. Or maybe I can just open it. One day, guys, like I swear, this is my first video and it will, you know, it's gonna get better. So, all right. Oh, look, 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 look. So it opens like this. Okay. Well, now I switch hands. Okay. All right, so it opened. This is nice. Uh, it is cardboard. I don't know what that is, but that is there. And this is the watch. 
Okay, so this is um, hey, look, it says non-returnable if this tag is removed. So whatever, whatever. I'm not returning it. Um, it is it is ticking. It's going. So it had to be wound or it's so this is automatic. So, you know, obviously it winds, I believe, like as you, you know, move your wrist. Um, they have the the brown band on. Let me see the condition of it. I mean, I was planning on getting a new one anyway. If you go on the Hamilton website, um you will see that um they have the watch you know, listed on there, but it's listed as out of stock, but you can buy the band. So my plan was to buy a brand new band, um, this brown one, and then um, just just keep it just in case, um, you know, I was to ever sell the watch again or, you know, whatever happens. Um, so like, you know, whoever may get it will have a fresh band. Um, and then I would say um, I'll probably just wear this one just as my everyday band. Um, you know, just this, I don't know, just use one. I, I, I pray it's fresh and clean or whatever, whatever. You know, and, and that's if I sell it. I probably won't sell it because it's like my first real watch. But, hey, you never know. You know, I might get, you know, I might want to trade up or whatever. I'm already thinking about my next one. Um, either I would probably want either like a Breitling or a Tudor um, as my, you know, next steps or whatever, real watches. And then maybe spend between, you know, two and four thousand, whatever, however life goes, whatever I'm blessed with, you know. Or I would just be happy with what I have. So um, looking at the watch. Oh, look, it looks like the looks like it's in pretty good condition. Is there any scratches on here? Doesn't look like no, no scratches. So that was just some some dust from the cardboard. I was a little kind of a little nervous. Um, so I mean the watch is beautiful condition. It's 42 millimeters. Um, as you can see, it has the six with the little cutout to you know um signify. Oh, I'm dropping stuff. Uh, Far Cry Six. Um, which is the game that you can unlock, you know, this watch on. And I'm not sure the capabilities yet, but I, but I unlocked the watch on the game. Um, I believe this is the pin thing that you can change the straps with. That looks brand new, untouched. And then this is the other band in like a green that you can, you can switch out. Um, I think the brown band looks the best. That's why I'm going to buy an extra and then just kind of every day rock the um this this one that i they, they came with it um whenever i'm not wearing my like apple watch or whatever to track workouts and all that good stuff so you know i'm interested definitely in a hobby um i, I still think electronic watches you know you know gadgets tech will still have their place but nothing like a, a good classic you know everyday watch that you can throw on um all right let me set this here uh, the, the, the Starbucks cup tripod that we're using <laughs> and we will pull out this drawer to see what's in here. Okay. So this drawer holds a watch holder. Looks like it's good condition. They did not do anything, you know, with this, um, thing to hold three watches in it. Looks good. Looks nice. Beautiful. Um, the warrant oh, international warranty book here which is great um this is i guess this is like the card that oh no it says oh okay so this is like the warranty card it has like numbers on it so i don't want to show that on camera um oops i keep dropping stuff the phone keeps ringing jesus christ um, so this says khaki feel, um, the, I don't know, what do you call this? The case is, it's titanium, it's 42 millimeters. And I mean, shoot, this is, this is a good watch. This is, this looks like a good first purchase. I'm, I'm pretty happy with this so far. Um, so 
I don't know if this, this this is another drawer. No, nothing else. So so this is the box. You know, it's not a it's not a Rolex box by by any means. Um, it's not a Rolex watch. Um, but thanks for watching my ten minute rambling and me dropping my phone. And you know, I try to keep going with with more videos and whatever you know crap that I buy. Like I always buy a bunch of stuff, and I'm like, oh, like I said, I'll do a video on it. Never do. Uh, but this time, this is a start, so thanks for watching.